How to decrypt the POCO X3 Pro Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video and in this video I'm going to show you how you can decrypt the POCO X3 Pro. Now, what are the prerequisites? Well, for starters, you need to have an unlocked bootloader, then you need to have a custom recovery installed and unfortunately, you also need to be on a custom ROM because at the time of recording this video, it is not possible to decrypt the POCO X3 Pro if you are on a stock ROM which is your stock MIUI. Now, videos for unlocking the bootloader, installing a custom recovery and installing a custom ROM can be found in the description of the video and right now we are running the Pixel Plus UI official ROM on our POCO X3 Pro. Another thing you need to note is that you are going to lose all your pictures, videos, anything important which you have on your device because we are going to perform a format data so make sure you have a backup of all those things. Next question which I will get is why do we need to decrypt our device? So decrypting your device is a choice. This is specifically for people like me who switch between a lot of custom ROMs and do not prefer to perform a format data every time you go from one ROM to another. Again, decryption is a choice and we do have another video talking about that which can be found in the description of this video. Now what are the files which you need? You need only one file and that file of course is the disabled force encryption. This is a zip file and linked in the description as well. So first up you can go into settings and security. Remove your screen lock, fingerprint and face unlock and while we are in security you will notice that encryption and credentials says phone is encrypted. Next thing I suggest you do is you can go into accounts and remove your Google account and any other account you have associated with the device. Once you have removed all the accounts, security measures, make sure you reboot your device once. Now why are we removing all the accounts and security measures? We are doing this because we are going to perform a format data aka a bigger factory reset and if you do not remove the accounts and security measures then on first boot up you will have to sign back into your Google account which I think is a pain anyways next thing we are going to do is we need to boot into our custom recovery so turn off your device and then once the device has turned off press and hold power and volume up power and volume up together till you see the custom recovery logo and in my case I am using TWRP recovery so here it is we have booted into twrp recovery and all you need to do is go into install and now navigate to the folder where you have the disable force encryption if you downloaded it on your phone directly it will be in the download folder i have transferred it from my computer so select the file and then swipe to confirm flash once that process has finished tap on the home button go into wipe format data type in yes and then tap on the check mark on the bottom right do note format data will result in wiping out of all your pictures videos anything important which you have on your device and once that is done all you need to do is select reboot system and there it is we do have the pixel plus ui boot animation on our poco x3 pro now do note we performed a format data so the first boot up might take some time and there it is we are on the setup screen let me skip the initial setup real quick and we have successfully booted to the home screen let us go into settings security and here it is encryption and credentials phone not encrypted which means we have successfully decrypted the poco x3 pro now do note every time you update your rom or install a new rom which is based on aosp you will have to flash disable force encryption before booting into the rom and with disable force encryption of course you avoid performing a format data every time you go from one rom to another and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you